Ay. You're muted. So I guess we're live. And we are. I see us. You want me muted? Oh, I wanted you unmuted. Um, I see that we are live. We are live in the group. It's great to be here. How are you? I see that. I was waiting to see if anyone else was going to come on, but it seems like we're the only two. Um, you're on time. How does your mouth feel? Can you hear me? Yeah, what'd you say? And how does your mouth feel? Oh, if you're streaming live on Facebook, I'd rather not talk about my personal stuff. Oh, no, I'm not. I'm. Oh, yeah, okay. I got you. I hear you. All righty. So, um, we're live. And we're going to start the session. So, we'll start in three minutes. And you're not coming in too good. You're, co you're either you're not picking up good or you're talking not into the microphone or something. I said we'll start in about three at seven after three after three minutes. Yeah, you are going, you are going in and out on the sound. Why is, it, why is that so? It's not it's not totally clear when you are. Sometimes it's good and sometimes no. it's not. I see that. Yeah, now it sounds better now. Okay, so I have to be right in front of my. Yeah. Okay. Um, this is authority. So let me do record and let us start. So. Good evening, good evening. Thank you for joining us. I am grateful that you are here. Life is good and honest. Father God, we say thank you. Cover this meeting that we may get the understanding of lesson three in accordance with the miracles, that all questions will be answered, if in fact we have any, that we may roll like you, God, and understand that this is a lesson and we are learning Together. We're on this journey together. So let us begin and we say thank you, Ashe. And so it is. So we are here and we're on lesson three uh, for the study group. And last week we went through lesson two. Lesson two was basically about mentioning things and seeing that they really meant to us. Just mentioning, seeing things with our eyes. And so lesson three is pretty much um, the same. Lesson three is pretty much the same. The same. Um, So let's go to A Course in Miracles and let's begin with lesson three. And I will lesson share. Lesson three. Oh, I will share the screen. So let me share the screen. See that? Hmm. Right. It's starting. Huh? It's, yeah, there it is. Okay, let's go. And of course, I'm going to just um, play it and we can read it as we go.
I do not understand anything I see in this room, on this street, from this window, in this place. Apply this idea in the same way as the previous ones, without making distinctions of any kind. Whatever you see becomes a proper subject for applying the idea. Be sure that you do not question the suitability of anything for application of the idea. These are not exercises in judgment. Anything is suitable if you see it. Some of the things you see may have emotionally charged meaning for you. Try to lay such feelings aside and merely use these things exactly as you would anything else. The point of the exercises is to help you clear your mind of all past associations, to see things exactly as they appear to you now, and to realize how little you really understand about them. It is therefore essential that you keep a perfectly open mind, unhampered by judgment, in selecting the things to which the idea for the day is to be applied. For this purpose, one thing is like another, equally suitable, therefore equally useful. Equally suitable and equally useful. So this, in this exercise, we are not putting meaning behind it, similar to last, week's lesson, uh, we are in fact just looking. So we're going to practice this right now. We're going to give it about two minutes. It doesn't have to be a lot of time, but as you go through the course of the day, the exercise itself is to not give meaning to stuff, not have an idea or remembrance of maybe what you used it for or, or, or when you got it or any of that. So as the course says, you are to just go and look with no judgment, no idea. Okay, so let's do that for a couple of minutes. 